So with uh, Crossfire coming out on December 6th and Frenzy coming out on December 7th of 1999, uh, on December 8th we got Undertow, which I haven't yet played Subtransit, but I want to say of the five, um, at least the four I have played of the Half-Life brought into Opposing Force maps here, they did for December, this one gained the most. This is, you know, it was never a bad map by any means in the ha original Half-Life, but it definitely I wouldn't say it was one of the favorites. I feel it works a lot better with the changes they made here and the new item placement. It's just a really good time. Of course, I haven't played it with real people. But, you know, my experiences with the bots can't be that far off from, like, a real deathmatch on a real group of people, you know? So, yeah, let's check it out. So, yeah, you're going to see immediately. what a Part of what I mean is that they added in the spores. And like unlike some of the other um, um, maps, which I've already discussed in the Frenzy video especially... Um, I feel they actually added them in a way that really helps you, like, the flow of the map by giving you a lot of play spaces to move. Also, you know, sniper rifle right in this area here. You can see right away that it's going to be a little bit chaotic, a little bit mischievous. Also, here's a spore launcher, too, which you're probably not going to use that much because, again, there still aren't actually that many spores. But, you know, it's there. It's useful. You can use it. So let's walk around this little area, but we'll start in the center area again real quick. Uh, this area hasn't changed too much. You know, obviously there's the wrench now. But, you know, is it going to be too super helpful? But it's there. Grab it. Use the um, healing stations if you need them and grab the shotgun. So, yeah, that's what I mean. You can, you can like, go over there. Um, it doesn't allow, me, allow you to immediately get into the sniper area. But if you grab here, at least you can kind of go around and eventually kind of, like, you know... No, 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 no. I always forget. You got to go this one. You got to go, like, this one here and then go around. So, you know, at least you don't have to use the ladder to get up there. You can also get into that corner there from, like, straight on. And you can get up to that one pretty easily now too so there's a lot of like a lot of the flow has been improved um it's still a little bit hard to get out of the river here but you actually get the barnacle in the river so if you're holding back uh like you know back on the like the s key uh you could use it to try to get out I'll, I'll try to show it off but it should be theoretically at least somewhat possible to actually get out of the water once you've in there which again you know helps you like the flow grab the knife grab the med kits if you need them grab an ed like a machine gun because that's always good uh, conveyor belts are basically the same. Not much to say about that there. Coming back that way, just show off real quick. Uh, you know, grab everyone's favorite Desert Eagle. And, uh, if you were to come this way and go into this room, this is where you, like, that one button is. I'm not gonna show it off. Just watch the original Undertow video I did on Half-Life. If you want to see people drown, it still works exactly the same there. Um, yeah, come this way, though. You know, grab the machine gun if you already haven't. I just want to make that really clear. Always grab a machine gun. In real life, too, if you see a machine gun lying around, maybe pick it up. Or maybe don't, because you're probably going to get arrested, and then the guard, like the army and the government and the police is probably going to be mad at you. I don't know. Anyway, um, grab some spores, use them to hook up if you want. We'll talk about this little area in a bit. We'll start, and then we'll go there next. Uh, come back this way, and this is where the other way you can kind of go. And, you know, grab the, again, like I, I, I've said before, the, whoever was doing these conversions really liked the Desert Eagle. I'm tired of watching the idle animation for it. Uh, climb up this way if you want to get to the, uh... This map here. But remember, if you have the barnacle from the river, you can get up here even easier. Um, I don't know why it's a shotgun. I would have put another sniper or a crossbow or something, but that's just my opinion. It's there. Use it. I think you spawn. You can spawn there anyway. So, you know, you might want to... You just... You need a weapon, damn it. So, let's... Oh, wait. I'm going the wrong way. Never mind. I suck cock. Uh, let's go this way so we can get into the uh, kind of drainage area here. Uh, not too much has changed, although it probably has, and I don't remember that. You know, there's a revolver there. You saw you got some explosives. You got a shock roach, which is stupid deadly here, thankfully, because not only is there a river, but there's also that water area. And if you happen to have this while the, like, the area is being, like, you're being drowned in that area, you can get, like, a ton of kills at the expense of ever trying to drown you. Because now there's a whole bunch of water everywhere. So this is actually, this might be the best map for the shock roach, or one of the best maps for it. It's awesome. It's great. I love that. Anyway, come this way. Come up here. And if you come up here, is how you can get into this area, which we'll talk about a little bit more here. As you saw, there was uh, some spores there. And since you had to grab the... I'll show it real quick. You have to grab the barnacle in the river. You can actually get out of the river from up here. So, you know, the, again, like I, just, I can't stress enough that the flow has just been improved so much in this map. Again, not that it was bad beforehand, but it was a little bit restrictive in some ways. I feel that so this, like, you know, using the barnacle here really solved a lot of that. Um, if you do decide to come in here, though... Because, again, we can't have um, we can't have the Egon in any of these opposing force maps, so instead it's the Gauze, which, you know, is probably the better option in the long run anyway, because, you know, people tend to like it. Long jump's still there, and the door to get out is still here. So, you know, that's cool. And you're gonna Gauze jump around, I don't really need to bring that up. So, yeah, let me show you what I mean. I'll get, come in here, or, you know, I guess I'll have to 
do this. Again, if you're holding back, or I guess forward here, and you did that fast enough, you could actually, like, you know, force your way out. Here, as you can see, yeah, look at that. I can get out of the river and get back up to the surface. Or, hey, I want to go up there, right? Well, I have a window of opportunity to do that where I'm not getting, like, immediately, like, yeeted down the river. So that is so cool. Anyway, but that's not what you're here for, though. Rocket launch is still there, but I don't think I picked it up. That's still good. This area got a lot going on for it now, though. Only one uh, spore, if I remember. So you can at least get up here. Let me take a peek. Yeah, that's it. There's no more in this area, which is a little disappointing. Because it would have been nice to be able to immediately get up here. But that might have made the uh, drowning button a little bit too powerful. So if you were to come in here, you can grab a machine gun, which is awesome. Um, there's a secret area here. Uh, and the cool thing about this secret area, this is probably one of the easier um, uh, displacer cannons to get in the game. You just slow down getting to it. But, you know, if you just basically come up from this way, you can basically just walk right in, go into that water, and have it. So, yeah, there's going to be a lot of shenanigans in this little area here. This is where you can grab the crossbow and another long jump if you didn't have it. Always fun, good stuff. Not much up here still, besides another shock roach. Never mind, I take that back. This map is so hardcore, it has two shock roaches. That's fucking insane. Especially right in the water area, so you can kamikaze immediately. Come up here. The machine gun's up there, but a submachine gun's up there, but I don't feel like getting back up there. Grab another Desert Eagle if you haven't grabbed one of the 50 other ones in the map. You also get healed up here. It's good. It's great. I like it. And then come down this way and get some batteries. And the elevator up to the, um, drowny area. And yeah, that's uh, Undertow in Opposing Force. It's fucking great. A lot of wrenches, though. I don't know what, like, you know, again, this is the same person's obsession with the, you know, Desert Eagles also applied to, um... Wrenches, I suppose. I fucked up getting that gauze, so fuck it. We're just gonna be a man and just fight hardcore. Oh, these grenade kills are fire right now. I'm not even intending this. I'm just insane. I am a monster. I've become the greatest. I've been playing, you know, this game so much recently. I've just become the greatest Half-Life deathmatch player of all time that ever existed in the history of everything. That's pretty fat fucking lie, and I suck cops, so never mind. But yeah, you can get out. Also, too, if you want to be bold, you can try to latch onto people and do this shit. Oh, damn, physics. Never mind, I'm disappointed. No, Spider-Man, you gotta get this. I'm gonna eat- You're getting bit by the radioactive freaking barnacle there, Spider-Man. Goodness gracious. Too bad I don't have the shock trooper. Oh, I want to get the shock roach so I can, like, show you my kamikaze skills. It's terrible. Yeah, let me redeem myself. I was doing this earlier, come on. Come on. Come on! There you go. See, you can get right back out there. I just really, really, really want to get the shock roach because I want to show what this is like. I mean, it works in the, like, the, um... What's the word I'm looking for? In this, like, little flow, too? But, you know, you want to get over here. Hopefully I don't get killed immediately or else I'm going to be so blue-balled. Hopefully there's someone in here. Let's go! I hate everything. Oh, wait, but wait. No, it's good. It's fine because there's a, shot. There's a roach here, too. Damn you, Cell. I'm going to get revenge on you. About to go Super Saiyan 5 on your ass. Yeah, here we go. And like I said, especially when it's flooded to, like, hell and back. I might do that anyway, just for the giggles. I mean, that was kind of a waste. No, I got two people, so never mind. It was fine. It's good. I'm satisfied. I can sleep tonight. All right. Oh. Oh, what is going on? Oh, I get my immediate revenge, though. You just spawn me right back at it. Oh, someone's flooding the area. I forgot that there's a siren for that, actually. I mean, obviously, as you can see here, I always forget that it uh, blocks off the river there. Like, the little flow there. Um, I, I'm gonna assume it does that in the original Half-Life as well. But the bots don't tend to ever activate that, except they did here. So this could be a great little asshole sniping spot. Just wait for people to show up there and trap them. Pro tip. You bring in a shotgun to a sniper fight, my friend. That ain't smart. Oh, I guess he ran away, so maybe that is smart. Never mind. I'm leaving. It's gotten really quiet, surprisingly so. Usually the bots are a little bit more rowdy. I'm probably about to die, yeah. Oh, hold on. Oh, my goodness. Oh, God, now I'm bringing the, the sniper to the, like, the SMG fight. That's no good. The tables have turned. Oh, man, this, is, this river gets so intense. Regardless of what version you're playing in. I mean, it's kind of lame that they put the machine gun right in the water here, because you can't use it until you surface a little bit. So it gets, it's a little bit tricky, you know? It's a little bit dangerous trying to use that. 
How did I miss? What? Instant revenge. Come on, civilian. What is going on? Ew, are you actually using the shock roach out of the water? What's wrong with you, New Line Void? Ah, uh, yeah, so that's Undertow in Opposing Force. It's actually great. I really w It's a really big shame this isn't officially included with the game. Well, it is official, but, you know, not included with the install. Never mind, I suck cock. <laughs>